One of uh, President Trump's promises is mass deportations, not only to solve the immigration problem, but also to solve the economic problem that the country is going through. So how long do you think that it will take to deport 11 million people undocumented who are living in the United States, according to DHS? How does the timeline look like to you? Well, I think Donald Trump will be the first to say that's a that is a tall order. It's very tough to know where everybody is who's coming to this country illegally. And yeah, you're right, 11 million. It's a lot of people that come in over the past three and a half years. I think the major concerns for him, and you heard him in his speech probably over the weekend, if you saw in Aurora, Colorado, mm -hmm. is he has said that he wants to make sure that the first people he gets out, and he's going to work with ICE, and he's going to work with Border Patrol and local police departments and sheriff's agencies to ensure that the gangs and the criminals are out of this country. This is America. We don't stand for these things. Donald Trump wants to get these people out of our country and ensure that every law-abiding citizen of the United States is safe and secure, and that is what he has promised um, a day one now, when he takes office. That, uh, a number of studies show that uh, undocumented immigrants commit less crimes than uh, American citizens. So, yes, there are some undocumented criminals. He wants to deport them. What, those are a minority. What happens after that? Will he be deporting the uh, parents of six million American citizens? Well, I think what he said is, again, that is a very tall order, and it's tough to do. I mean, the reality is when people come into this country, they're given a court date that sometimes is nine, ten years later than, than you know, the current date. A lot of these folks you can't track. A lot of these folks are hard to, to track down. Our viewers... Uh, some of them might agree with this, uh, deporting criminals, but some of them also wonder if after those bad guys are deported, will good guys be deported also, like TPS beneficiaries, parole beneficiaries? What will he be doing with those immigrants, with, uh, with DACA recipients? Well, I think Donald Trump will be the first to acknowledge that we, we do have a broken immigration system. And if these are people who want to come, go through a process and legally immigrate to our country, maybe we need to have a long conversation about how to ensure that that happens.